find the equation for the tangent plane defined explicitly at the indicated point. So our explicitly defined surface here is z is equal to 7 minus 4x squared minus 3y squared, and we are given the point for 2. So the first thing that we need to do here is find the ordered triplet. So we want to find p naught, which is defined as a, b, f of a, b. And so our given point here, we have that a, b is equal to 4, 2. And we want to find its corresponding z. So we'll substitute these values in. So I have z is equal to 7 minus 4 multiplied by 4 squared for 16 minus 3 multiplied by 2 squared, which is 4. So this gives us 7 minus 64 minus 12 for a beautiful final answer of minus 69. So therefore we can say P naught, which is defined by the components A, B, F of A, B, are equal to 4, 2, minus 69. And we are now ready to go ahead and find that normal vector defined by the gradient. So we want to keep in mind here as we go about finding the gradient that we only need the partial derivative with respect to x and y. So we have the partial derivative of our surface here with respect to x is minus 8x. The partial derivative with respect to y is going to leave us with a minus 6y. And now evaluating this at the given point here, we have the partial derivative at the point 4, 2 is negative 8 times 4, which is minus 32. We have the partial derivative with respect to y at the point 4, 2. Gives us negative 6 multiplied by 2, which is a minus 12. And so we can say that our gradient at the point 4, 2 is defined by the vector negative 32, negative 12. And so now we are ready to find the equation of our tangent plane. And using the equation here for an explicitly defined surface, we know that the tangent plane is defined as z is equal to the partial derivative with respect to x at the point ab times x minus a plus the partial derivative with respect to y at the point ab multiplied by y minus b plus the surface evaluated at that point ab. So plugging everything in that we just found, we have z is equal to negative 32 multiplied by x minus 4 minus 12 multiplied by y minus 2 plus a negative 69, so minus 69. And now we're ready to go about simplifying. So we'll distribute negative 32 through to both terms. We'll distribute this negative 12 through to both terms and then combine up any like terms. So we have z is equal to negative 32x plus 128 minus 12y plus 24 minus 69. So we want to go ahead and add up all of our like terms here. So we have z is equal to minus 32x minus 12y, and then 28 plus 24 minus 69 leaves us with plus 83. So bringing all of our variables to the left-hand side here, we are left with a beautiful final answer of 32x plus 12y plus z is equal to 83. And so this is our final answer for the equation of the tangent plane.